those. I'm selling those. Before they go, I'm gonna show you how they ended up after three years. Add it up. I would say they look pretty alright, however, I take good care of kites. I don't keep them on the beach, I think that's key. When you pump them, you go kite, and when you finish, you pack it down. They come with a compression bag, just like this really lightweight bag. It doesn't give a lot of protection, but it's very light. So when you travel, use, you know, an airplane where they count every grams, then it's a good feature. I mostly left the bags at home, so they look quite nice. This part of the Dacron even has no sign of too much wear. The whole canopy is in a quite good condition. It's not crispy anymore, but they have a couple of hundred hours flying in it. During these three years, we had a lot of fun time. But the 12 was serving me mostly between 10 and 18 knots. And the 9 was a loop machine, anything above 18 knots. Where and how did I use them? We started in Kenya for a solid three months where they were used equally. That was a great time and mostly kiting. So we used them there quite a lot. 2020 summer we came here to Lake Como and that was a very solid summer because the wind was humping often above 20 knots so again a lot of time spent on the night. After this we went to Sicily for a half month and a half. That's altogether one year of kiting. The next year we went back to Como again, five months, yeah, Sicily again, we always do that. And then eventually in 2021 we went to Brazil and to Costa Rica with them. and like boom every day on the nine so the young nine got a little bit more use at the end you see those small scratches because of the beach and because of some more rocks you know you can't avoid that unless you're kiting from a boat these guys are not mega light on the other side because of the strong build they last The bar condition and the line conditions. But look, the lines itself are well made. A little decolorification, decolorizing. How do you say that? It lost its color a little bit, but you don't see much of a wear here. One thing, when when you looped it or crank it in too much, here there was a small sickness of this bar that you know when you pull like this, it goes into the chicken loop. And yeah, it happened on the nine bar as well, which I'm not selling. It's I love it, I'm not gonna sell it ever, I think. It's the smallest bar I ever had. It's really nice. The chicken loop, looking good. Now I'm gonna check the lines. If you don't know how to do it, I have a video about it. Yeah. Ready to go. What's the conclusion? I tried a small brand and they lasted just as well than any other brand I tried. I think that's a good thing at the end. Thank you.